Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. If somebody's trying to engrave on the back of an acrylic wards, awards, and they'd like this thing grouped together and then flipped over in a macro on multiple pages. I can't figure out how to do it on multiple pages, but I can figure out how to do it on one page at a time and make a shortcut key to make it easier. <clears throat> so if you'll go to Tools and Script, yours might say Macros, and start recording. We're going to call it page two because I've already got a page and hit OK. As soon as you hit OK, it starts recording. Control A will group, select everything together. Control G will group it together. And then we can mirror it the other way. Now we'll go to tools and scripts and stop recording. We'll flip this guy back around like it was. Matter of fact, we'll ungroup it like it was. <clears throat> so now we're gonna go to tools, scripts, macros, and here's our macro for page two. And we click on it, double click, and it did it. So now we can right click on it and assign it a keyboard court shortcut, which I've already done, it's called F. Well, we're just gonna put F again and assign it and say okay. Now let's put this back like it was. So we can go to page one and hit F. We can go to page two and hit F, three and hit F, and so on and so on. It will group them together and mirror them the other way so he can engrave on the back of the awards. If anybody else knows how to do it on multiple pages at one time, I would appreciate that little insight and I will let people know about it. But other than that, that's about as far as I can make it go. So it really makes it easy because you go to page 10 and just hit the letter F. And I just picked F for flip because it wasn't being used. So it's easy enough just to do all the pages like that one at a time. I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.